Hey, what's going on everybody? Made some changes to the website. Um, I posted on YouTube in the little comment section and on the Facebook business page and Instagram. So some of you guys have already got to see this. So what happens is this is your landing spot by computer, not by uh, mobile device. So if you scroll down, it's just stuff here. Just letting people know soccer cards will be coming up in about a week or so on here. And this will change out too. But now when you come down, you'll have the three sections here. Soccer will be over here. Uh, eventually, I'll get hockey and Pokemon and all that stuff on there. See, Pokemon's here, but not here. So you can click directly on this, and it'll take you there. There's images here of just going from high to low, what's in some of the folders or whatever you want to call it. So if you click on baseball cards, it'll pull them all up. A lot of this stuff you guys see from the shows and stuff like that there. Uh, same rules will apply. Anything forty nine over forty nine dollars is free shipping. Um, there's no sales tax being charged. I covered in the price, so regardless if you're in a no sales tax place or not, I covered across the board and paid end of the year type deal. So just take that in a little bit of consideration, um, if you don't mind, on some of the pricing on too. I try to stay pretty much maybe a couple dollars lower on eBay just because I take in a sales tax myself on to it. All right, so there's that. The other one, you can hit any of these three categories here. If you guys want to buy from BCW here, um, come up here, cards for sale. Hit all cards for sale to pull them all up, most expensive down. So it'll be every card that's listed on the site. Dominique Wilkins, flawless, uh, three-color patch, auto out of 10. Uh, Mike Evans, silhouette rookie, three-color patch. That's orange up there. Jordan Fuego. A lot of this stuff I was going to grade. Um, and I'm just going to put it flat out just because of where the submission levels are and stuff like that. I just won't be grading anytime soon. If they open it up, I'll start pulling stuff off the website and stuff. There are some graded cards on to here as well, too. Uh, Matt Ryan's rookie, Wentz rookies, the, the coveted Wander Franco from Bowman's Best this year. You got the Elite Series from 92, Don Ross. I think there's some 95s on here, too, somewhere probably towards the bottom. And this here will help me be able to keep it more updated, too, by looking at pricing, along with going to the shows. If there's a show scheduled that weekend, the store will be blank until I get back, which means I only set up once every other month, so... Um, let me go back up to the top. All you got to do is, if you want to know if I have a show that weekend, go to the calendar... And then I'll just show you guys what it looks like. March, if you go to Derby City, it says set up on it. means I'll be set up there. So that means the store will be shut down Friday till I get back. But I'm trying to keep also, if you guys got local card shows that are pretty good, you only put on here, I will. Uh, this is just stuff for me, basically. And then let people know I'll be going to shows out this way uh, to look at cards. Uh, a lot of times some people want to pick stuff up in person, stuff like that, too. Last thing, if you want some of my bigger graded cards, those are all going to be on my slabs. So you pull up my slabs, and you'll pretty much see the bigger stuff that's on here and stuff like that there. Eventually, I'll start moving the stuff back and forth between the two. I don't like keeping them on both sites at the same time frames. It's harder for me to track. Uh, that's pretty much it. Um as you guys know, Extreme Bucks, if you click on this, this is usually when we do the live uh, sales. People just want to pay by credit card. You can do that. My uh, payment processor is Stripe. So that's been in effect now, I think, since like April or something last year. I have to figure out why this hasn't changed here yet. Still learning coding on it, so just bear with me. But like I said, if you go to the homepage, you just want to see baseball, basketball, or football, click it. I took out all the like dollar fifty cent cards and stuff like that in there, unless it's something that's you know older and pretty good shape that I think you know I know some people out there collect that player. I'll leave it on there for about a month or so, then I'll start rotating stock like normal onto it. Um, I think that's pretty much it. Like I said, if you guys want to get BCW supplies, they're up there. This is not through me. That takes you right to their website. Facebook page is there if you guys want to join. I don't really post there that much, to be honest. I know some people post cards for sale and shows and stuff like that. If and when I get personal boxes, they'll be here. Um, normally, I announce that on the uh, YouTube channel. That's the YouTube channel for people to go straight from there. 
but pretty pretty much uh, a lot of coating I had to get redone onto it and make it kind of smooth out. Like there's still hockey card on here. I gotta get that taken off. But I at least wanted to get this out so everybody can see the changes onto it. I'm not too sure. Like I said, what it looks like for mobile. I didn't go on my mobile onto it yet. It should be pretty much compatible. But if you only like baseball or only like basketball, football, just scroll down. You can click on it. It's going to come up from the highest to the lowest. There's no mixed by years or nothing like that. Um, you can sort yourself however you want, though, onto here. That is an option for you. Nude old. The other way is you can come up in here and type in, oops. That's only if I had a whole lot of people. Like if I wanted once cards, type it in, pulls it up right that way too. So just a real quick with thing with the update on to it all. I just wanted to push it out. Uh, that way you guys can see what I'm looking at as a customer on my own website. And that's for everybody. If you guys have any questions or anything, you can always hit me up. Email extremecardbreaks at gmail.com. It'll always be in the description. If you guys got other means of getting in contact with me too, you can hit me up on there. Other than that, guys, thank you very much. Appreciate the support to the channel, to the store, and everything. Catch you guys next video.